who's ready to play with makeup. Hello. I'm wearing a shirt, FYI. Just want to make that clear. It has a deodorant stain on the front, but that's fine. I have not noticed it for the entire video that I was wearing it. Just noticed it now. I was in a mood to just play with makeup today. It's as simple as that. I just wanted to play with some colour and just do another full glam makeup look. We've gone for some pinky vibes today. We haven't gone for a... I mean, I could have gone cool tone. Does this still count as warm tone because it's pink? Okay, it's still different. I wouldn't usually do this look anyway, so we're just doing a... Get ready with me. Well, it's not. We're just doing a full glam look for just doing nothing. I'm just here to keep you company for a little while and keep you occupied, entertain you, if I can do that and just have a chat. My coffee looks gross now because the ice is melted. So just grab a drink, grab a snack. I've ate mine. If you like the look of this, you want to see how I did it, you want to have a little chat, get rid of yourself even if you're not doing anything. So if you just want to have a chill time with me then subscribe if you want to, give the video a thumbs up as well and um, and we'll start getting ready. Hi, okay we, okay we clearly need some help. We're not looking too great right now. I don't know what it is but I kind of like hot pink right now. Don't know why, not like to wear, but like makeup wise, I'm just kind of into like really bright colors. So I'm thinking about doing maybe like a hot pink eye look, maybe, we'll see how this goes. I need to get dressed, I should probably get dressed actually, cause we're in a hoodie, we look like shit basically. So yeah, grab a snack. Um, I've actually got a little snack here and my coffee as always. I've got some coconut bites, some chocolate coconut bites. I love these, these are actually really good. I hate the fact that they put like two in the bag. These are so good. I've done my eyebrows. I hadn't filled them in with a pencil for such a long time and it took me a while because I kind of forgot how to do them and because my hair under my brows has kind of grown it took an extra long while. So I've done my eyebrows and I put on the Too Faced lip injection so um, we can get some nice plump lips. Okay so I'm thinking I might actually do the eyes first today. I usually start off with the face, but then kind of go in between. But I think, because I'm doing something with really bright colours, just in case of any fallout or anything, I think we'll do the eyes first. So I'm just going to put a mist on before I start the eyes. So, I mean, this is a setting spray, but I'm just going to use it anyway. It's the Pretty Fresh Hyaluronic Acid Mist from Colourpop. I love this. Okay, get some hydration there. Okay, first things first, we're going to prime the eyes. I'm going to use my P. Louise eyeshadow base. I don't know whether to go and do one eye off camera. Should I do that? I feel like that might make it easier because then I'm not faffing around. I'll prime my eyes super quickly. I'll go do one eye so I can know what I'm doing and then I'll come back and then show you what I've done. Okay, so I've gone with this for the eye look. So I'll just kind of breeze through the eye look and then... I'll talk through doing the face makeup because that's probably what's going to take the most time. Yeah, it's actually quite easy to do. There's just a lot of blending. I'm using this palette. It's the Revolution Pro Mischief Mattes palette. It's mainly this pink, really. I haven't used that many colours. So, yeah, I'll show you what I'm doing.
buying a pen from your store. You know who she is? Sure, yeah, that's Cynthia. Okay, so my I am wearing a shirt. Okay, let's just be clear about that. Okay, so the eyes are all done. I just went and put my mascara on. I used the Colourpop BFF mascara. I realised I did show it, but it's all scratched off, so you probably can't see what it is. Okay, so my favourite time, face makeup. I wanted to kind of use a lot of my favourite products as well, stuff that I love for like really full glam or just my favourite stuff, but I tried not to use any of the same stuff that I use in my last kind of like full glam get ready with me kind of thing so we've got some different stuff that I love as well so primer I'm going to use the Fenty Pro Filter Hydrating Primer honestly one of my favourite face primers and it like blurs your skin as well so I like putting it across like my nose and just like here as well and it's really hydrating as well Okay, foundation wise, I think I might have to mix another foundation in, but I want to use pretty much my favourite foundation, one of my favourite foundations. It's either this or the LA Girl Illuminating Foundation, but this is the Laura Mercier Flawless Lumiere Radiating, no it's not, the Radiance Perfecting Foundation. I got this when it was the summer, so I feel like it, yeah, it's clearly too dark, so I'm, uh gonna have to put a bit of this in which is just the white foundation from LA Girl. So I'm gonna use this brush again. This is from one of my last videos. It's the Brushworks brush from one of my last videos. I love this for foundation like honestly. I just feel like my straw was like in the middle. I love that foundation so much. It's so good. For concealer, I'm going to use the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Concealer. Oh my God, has anyone seen his new palette that he's coming out with? The what's is it? The cremated palette or something? It looks so cool. I kind of want it, but then like I don't think I'm like cool toned enough to use it fully so like I don't think I'd get enough use out of it but it looks so good honestly he just he's an absolute queen like honestly I wish I could like be listening to my music right now like while I'm filming but we obviously can't do that I've just been watching Big Bang Theory I kind of like watching TV I don't know if I've said this before but I don't like doing anything in like silence I literally can't. I even have to like fall asleep with like my iPad on. I know that's really bad, but like I just need some sound. So like while I've been doing like my eyeshadow and stuff, I've been watching Big Bang Theory. I've nearly finished it. I've watched it so many times, but then I always forget to watch like the last season. So I'm on season 11 right now. So I'm almost done with that. I've been watching Big Bang Theory since I was literally in high school. So I literally love it. What else have I been watching? Oh my god, I really like New Girl. I think I mentioned this in another video, if anyone's seen that. It is so good and like, I find it absolutely hilarious. I feel like if you've never seen it, but you just want to like, see if you'd think it's good. You no, know, because it might like, give some spoilers away, but season four, episode six, but it's called The Background Check or something like that. I was literally crying today. I was watching that episode and that is by far, I mean, I'm only up to season four, but that is by far the funniest episode I have ever seen. It's one of the funniest things I've just ever seen on TV, ever. Like, it is so good. So if you've ever wanted to watch it, but you know, now's the time. You're not doing anything at home. Most people aren't doing anything at home anyway. So honestly, watch it. Season four, episode six, the background check one. Just watch that episode, it's, you will not regret it. Like, you will be crying. If you don't find it funny, if you don't cry at it, then there's something wrong with okay. it. Okay, to set my face, I'm gonna use the Hourglass Veil Powder. I always forget that I have this Hourglass Powder. Honestly, look how smooth that powder's made my skin. Like, the combination of like that primer, the concealer, the, uh, I'm just gonna finish the lower lash line quickly, I think. I'm gonna use Exclusive, which I didn't actually use this shade, it's this one here. 
I didn't actually use this on the top of the eyes. It's kind of like a pinky purple. I didn't use it before, but I just want to use a different color for the lower lash line. For bronzer, I'm going to use this Cover FX little palette. I'm going to use the matte shade first and then I'm going to go over with the glowy one. For blush, we're going to go for an oldie Luminoso by Milani. I wanted something quite pink to go with the eyes. Okay, I'm just going to mist my face while I'm just going to set it. I'm just going to use the same Colourpop spray that I used before. Then for highlight, we're going to use one of my faves, the Melt Stargazer Highlight. Okay, time to just finish up. So for lips, I think I'm gonna go with one of my favorite nudes. We're gonna go all out, we're gonna put a gloss on. Okay, I know I use this in like every single video, but you know what, it's my favorite lip liner and nothing can beat it, but it's Cafe from LA Girl. She's a winner. Okay, again, I know I used this recently as well, but it's just like one of my faves. It's uh, by Colourpop, it's the ultra matte lip in the Spanish words that I can't say. Okay, maybe we could have gone pinkier. Actually, wait, the gloss is pretty pink. Anyway, we're gonna go over top with one of my favorite glosses. It's Unreal from Hourglass. Or is it called Child? Oh. Um... <laughs> So for this entire time I've had this for like a year and I always thought the shade was called Unreal but they're actually called the Unreal High Shine Lip Glosses. Okay, the shade is Child. Almost forgot but just to finish off I just wanted to put a bit of body highlight on because I feel like when I'm, you're in the top like this you just kind of need some glow. So I don't really like using this on my face that much just because it's got like glitter in it and it's like noticeable glitter, but I really love the highlight anyway. It's the Supreme Frost from Jeffree Star and it's Wet Dream. Pop a bit on. I'm gonna have to use my viewfinder as the mirror. So what am I even doing? That will do. Okay, so that is our lip gloss. That's why I don't wear lip gloss. Okay, I think we're done here. So I hope we enjoyed this get ready with me once again. We enjoyed this. I hope I've distracted you or just kept you company for a little while. If you like it, let me know. If you think it looks like shit, let me know as well. And as always, I'm gonna go have some food. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and give the video a thumbs up if you did like the makeup look and I will see you in my next video.